narcissist negativity has nothing to do with you. It feels as though no matter what you do, you can never satisfy the narcissist. You can never meet their expectations, needs or desires. The narcissist never believes in you. They never appreciate you or support what you are doing. Their negativity has an effect on you. It influences your thoughts, feelings, actions and behaviours. Our brains have this survival mechanism to focus on the negativity first and amplify it to protect us. When our brains focus on the negativity and amplify it, it has a strong emotional effect on us. We need to focus on positivity. We need to be positive or optimistic in attitude. We need to focus on gratitude. We need to focus on being thankful for the positivity we already have in our lives. When you are focusing on the narcissist negativity, you are focusing on something that has nothing to do with you. It is not your negativity, it is theirs. When a person is negative, it is an expression of themselves. It is an expression of how they feel about themselves and it is projected outwards onto you. But it really has nothing to do with you. The narcissist is too weak and fragile to deal with their own painful negative emotions. So they choose to project them onto you. They want you to express those emotions for them. It relieves the tension within them by regulating their emotional state and boosting their self-esteem. You need to recognize that the narcissist negativity has nothing to do with you. Their negativity is an expression of how they feel about themselves. Narcissists are very hateful, angry, envious and jealous people. You are not going to find any peace, love or joy within them. So all they can really do is express their hate, anger, envy and jealousy. Just as if you were to talk to a happy or positive person they are going to express happiness or positivity because that is how they feel about themselves. Narcissists are deficient in happiness and positivity. They don't have any within them. So they don't have any to give to you. They have a negative amount. So all they can give to you is negativity. They get envious and jealous. It makes someone to take your happiness and positivity away. This is something they have to do to make themselves feel more comfortable. Because any time that they are around you and you appear to be happy or positive, it reminds them of their inadequacies or insecurities. It reminds them of how they are not happy with themselves. They don't feel positive and they want to destroy that reminder. They may even feel as though you are attacking them just by you being happy or positive. Because your happiness and positivity triggers them to reflect on how sad and negative they are. 
Narcissists view their feelings as facts. If they feel a certain way, they believe that you cause them to feel that way. Even if you did nothing to them. In their minds you are attacking them. Just by being happy or positive. It motivates them to want to tear you down. And put you beneath them. Because you are a walking reminder of everything they are not. Everything they wish they were. And they want to destroy that reminder. So they don't have to reflect on how sad and negative they constantly feel. So they will express their negativity. They have to act on their emotions. They are not going to self reflect or look within. Because it's too painful for them to deal with. Narcissists are very weak and fragile. They don't want to deal with their emotions. They prefer to project them onto other people and get them to express them. It provides them with temporary relief. It regulates their emotions and boosts their self-esteem. But it never sustains them. They always go back to feeling sad and negative. No matter how much they abuse you, they will never be satisfied. Over time the abuse will escalate, because like a drug, they need more and more to get the same feeling that they had in the beginning. But it never satisfies them. It never sustains them. It's never enough. Because the problem is within them, and nothing outside of them can resolve that problem. The only way for them to resolve it is by them going within and dealing with their emotions. But of course, narcissists are very weak and fragile, so that is something they don't want to do. And this is why they remain in this endless cycle, doing the same things again and again, expecting a different result. The narcissist's negativity has nothing to do with you. Their negativity is an expression of how they feel about themselves. But when you are around them, you may find yourself reacting to their pain and discomfort. You may find yourself tuning into their frequency. While you may have been positive or happy before interacting or engaging with them, following it you find yourself experiencing the same pain and discomfort that they feel. Instead of tuning into their frequency and taking on their emotions, take control of what frequency you tune into. Choose to stay happy and positive. Choose to stay in the high vibrations of peace and love instead of arguing or fighting. If you react to them, you will be tuning into their frequency. You will become their vibration. So just let go. Focus on your happiness and positivity. Focus on peace, love and joy. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at narcsforthecoaching at gmail.com. Check out the merchandise in the Narcsforthe store where you can purchase your own Narcsforthe t-shirt, tank top or mug. The link is in the video description. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.